Is it a sin to get angry? I don't think so. But still, I believe we need to be careful in how we act when we get angry. Myself. I have to be careful of what I say, my tone, and my actions when I get angry. If I am already, I guess I can say, irritated, I don't want to let my, or I don't want to place my anger on someone who does not deserve it. If you understand what I am trying to say, even if a person deserves it, I should not want to do that. I should not be willing to raise my voice at a person. I should not be willing to curse a person out or blame that person for stuff he or she has not done. I have to be careful when I get angry. Because when I get angry, I think it is so easy to act improperly. And you may say, why do you say that, Kevin? Aren't we going to reap what we sow? If you look at Colossians 3 and 25, and I don't have it, I may not quote it properly, but in essence, I believe it is saying when you do wrong, wrong is going to come back to you. So if I wrongfully raise my voice at a person, if I wrongfully act rude to a person, if I wrongfully treat a person in a wrong way, isn't that going to come back to me? I think I already have issues in life. Why should I compound them if I am using that word correctly? Why should I compound them if I don't like issues in life? If you are the type to get angry fast, observe yourself. To me, I think yelling at a person is so wrong. I think that may be the first step in having a bad interaction with another person. I think what happens first, people's voices begin to raise. Then when that happens, I think worse things begin to happen. So to avoid that, Keep with a calm voice. There is no need to raise your voice. I can see if you are disciplining your child, okay. But if you are talking to another adult, do not raise your voice. Myself, I really dislike anyone raising their voice at me. I am not a child. I am not a kid. I may joke at times and stuff like that, but I am not a child. Like for me, if someone yells at me, I really don't like it. I really don't like it. I don't like too much rudeness, if you understand what I am trying to tell you. I think we are going to reap in everything. I think everything, how can I say this? 
I think everything that pertains to life, I think we are going to reap. I don't want to be prideful. I don't want to be bitter. I don't want to be hateful. So what do you believe I do? I believe I try to watch how I am. Yes, I could be manipulative in a bad way. I could be, you know, hateful and, and yell at people and control people in a bad way. But why would I do that? I think I would have to reap. I don't want to reap bad things. I want blessings in my life. I want good things in my life, which I do have good things. And I believe God has blessing me, have been blessing me. So I want more of that. Just because someone deserves to get yelled at doesn't mean I should yell at that person. Just because I should be, I guess, rude to a person doesn't mean I should do it. We have to think about God's rules more than earthly logic. Earthly logic may tell you you have the right to do wrong if someone has wronged you. But spiritual logic, in the way of God, we should not pay evil with evil. Some people may believe I am weak and I am a pushover and stuff like that, but do you know why I do certain things? I don't want more evil to come to me if I were to do evil. So if you believe I am a pushover or whatever else, think that way. But I think if you continue on doing wrong, I think it is not wise to expect things to get better for you if you want to do wrong because I believe you will receive from the wrong that you have done. So please, yes, we may make mistakes. I know, I believe many of us or all of us may not do everything right, okay but strive for perfection. Don't purposely treat a person wrong because you feel like they are disrespecting you. No. Me, yes, I don't like to be treated in a mean way, but I am not going to do the same thing as that person if they are doing wrong. Because won't I get punished as well? I believe so. So be wise. Don't pay evil with evil. If you think I have wronged you, don't wrong me back. Because now I think you are going to get in trouble. If I have wronged you, back down. If you have wronged me, I should back down, which I usually do most times. Let God do what he does and let you stay in the clear and do what is right. Do you understand what I am trying to tell you? Let me stop here. God bless you.